According to an affidavit, 17-year-old George Gervas arrived at the Elkhorn High School parking lot the night of October 11th, hours before the crash that claimed his life. Using data from his Snapchat account and testimony from a friend in his car, Omaha police say Gervas went to the school to buy alcohol from three other students. Police say one of the students' phones showed he'd been to the quick shop on 156th and Blondo and had a contact saved as Kevin Quick Shop. Police believe Kevin is 29-year-old Kevin Hart, a clerk at the quick shop. Investigators say one of the minors texted Kevin Quickshop just 30 minutes before meeting with Gervas, asking, quote, so we can come in and buy ALK? The response, yep, just got in. Prosecutors believe Hart sold the teens several containers of vodka, rum, and malt liquor without asking for ID and pushing an instant button to bypass the system. For those adults who procure it or provide it, knowing that these individuals are minors is really... Um, it's really unfortunate and sad. Officers questioned Hart October 20th. They say he admitted to routinely selling alcohol to minors. Hart and two teenagers are now in custody. Prosecutors plan to charge them with procuring alcohol, resulting in death. This is serious. You know, life is short and, you know, they shouldn't be drinking in the first place. Now, toxicology results show George Gervas's blood alcohol registered at 0.217. Police say they even smelled alcohol at the crash scene. Prosecutors tell us they may file more charges in this case. Hart will be in court Wednesday, and we will be there.